Welcome back to Hank Hill's Super Cool Manga Reviews. And fuck, I forgot to get a new co-host. Maybe my boy Bobby changed his mind about the show. I gotta go find him, but where would he be? I am a fashy epic gamer, and libtards think I'm racist because I'm master race. Clearly not any other reason. I'm your Aryan Princess Trad wife. Buy me something, you beta orb. I I meant Uberschmidt. Freaking epic! <laughs> I am the evil Jew bought nine sales, and oh, I will prevent you from getting traditional gamer girl Aryan feed, old oh, boy. It's time for the fancy gamers to rise up! Yeah! Freaking epic! This is so freaking relatable! <laughs> Look, Bobby, I do not mind you staying here till things cool down with your dad, but can you stop screaming Day of Rope in your sleep? Well, I expected more from the quote unquote honorary Aryans. What? You chink fucks might be smart and shit, but your people still lack the creativity that the Aryan man has. Why watch anime when you can watch According to Jim on DVD? Chinese? I am not Chinese. My dog and tools haven't been melted yet. I don't give a fuck. My Irish ancestors wrote the Constitution, so therefore I get your property and get to fuck your wife. Ow! Just like the inventor of comedy, Sam Hyde once said, I'm blacklisted. Bobby, where have you been? I was used as a Chinese sex slave. The cats and spicks were involved too. They jealous of my luscious Aryan beauty. Well, man, bullshit, Bobby. Nobody rapes fat kids. Not even Nickelodeon producers. I'm not fat. I'm husky. Bobby, I've been thinking. And well, uh, my last show with Bling Bling Boy wasn't epic. But you, Bobby, I feel like me and you have a connection. You're like a son to me. Sorry, Daddy, but it's going to take a lot more for me to be your co-host again. Well, I knew you say something like that, so I bought you something. You can't bribe me with materialistic objects. I ain't no consumer or slave to the cock machine. I have ascended past my degenerate materialistic urges. I got you bionicles. Oh, frick yeah. So, Daddy, what are we going to review today? Today's manga is the quiz. It's about contestants playing a quiz that punishes the losers. Instead of walking down the dock of shame to the boat of losers, you fucking die. I love it when people who don't look like me die. Gets me hard. That's freaking epic. Now, I felt like the manga did a good job at, at keeping me hooked, but I felt the ending uh, was rushed and forced. It kind of ruined the story for me. Just like how the coons ruin rap music. Vanilla ice for life. Bobby, try to stay focused, god damn it. Anyway, what I really like was the psychological elements of the manga, as the feelings of the contestants are pushed to the very limit. Psychology? Psychology is a trick of the cocks, dad. Dumbass therapist bitch had the nerve to call me a psycho when I said I wanted to scalp her in the day of the rope. Fuck you, Dad, for trying to demoralize me with your libtard propaganda from fucking Ching Chong Ching Chong land. I quit. Well, looks like I need to get a new co-host. Who should be the next co-host of Hank Hill's Super Cool Manga Reviews? Vote A for Joe Swanson. Vote B for Ben Shapiro. Vote C for Review Bra.